why this cow's hoof grows like this. Look how straight that right leg is. And I know everybody kind of is waiting for me to get pooped on, but. Hey there guys, I'm Aaron Lavoie, the Midwestern Hoof Trimmer. And in this video, we're gonna be looking at a cow whose hoof is growing very funny. We're gonna explain what's going on there and why her hoof looks like this. And I'll take you through a couple other trims and we'll also take one that had some pretty uneven wear and very crooked legs. See what we can do with her, straighten her out. Maybe, I don't know, let's see. So I'm going to show you guys what was going on with this foot, why I trimmed it the way that I trimmed it. So her extra heel height over here was tilting her in towards her toe, causing her to wear too much at the tip of her toe. And this height over here was also leaning her over, which is why she had the breakdown on her white line there. That's just a little bit of manure stain left. It's nothing. There's no crack there or anything. So now I'm going to put this hoof down and like I like to do, take you guys around the back to see how she stands. All right. You see how straight that right leg is and how offset her left leg is because of the heel height she's got on her outside claw on the left leg. And I know everybody kind of is waiting for me to get pooped on, but um, I can kind of cue off of her. Pretty good at doing that without getting pooped on. All right, but they're waiting for this cow, so I gotta get the rest of her trimmed. Pedro's waiting too. Oh, you got a nice earring. We'll put this foot back down after I'm finished trimming it. I'll show you how we straightened it out as well. So again, this is her weight bearing claw or the main weight intended claw. Put me over here. And by taking this over and back, we took the pressure off of her toe here and off of the weight line here. And now you can see how she's got her foot underneath her and pointing forward. How much better is that? Okay, they're waiting for her, so. That's one of the hard parts of that video in this. We're still trying to do our job here. And these cows got to get to the party and stuff. We're going to take just a short break here and I'm going to sharpen some knives.
All right, so we're gonna talk about why this cow's hoof grows like this. The hoof doesn't actually grow like this. All the hoof grows evenly. It wears like this. So she's wearing incorrectly. Now this cow is wearing too much out here. She's building up sole here. That's causing her to lean over this way and to not wear on the inside of this claw. So she just keeps accumulating more and accumulating more and it just keeps accumulating in this direction as hoof horn is constantly being formed. So let's see what I can do with this ugly foot. Easy mama. Easy mama. This might look a little bit strange while it's up in the air. But once we put it down, both of these claws are going to square up properly, aligning with their bone structure. And that's just a little manure. We're not worried about that at all. I could tell instantly from her foot placement how well she's straightened out. That's one thing that the balance method is about, is we're not only taking off of one spot or the other, we're only taking off where the cow is not wearing properly. Only giving them what they need. this claw that's why she had that bruising there now we've brought her over and over this way taking her off of that and then we also did some modeling just to relieve that area for a little while now that might look funny like how's she gonna stand on that and she's very nervous but that's how she's gonna stand on that now this girl's very shook up she was the last cow of her group and she's not happy that she's separated from the rest of the group that's why she's battling her and she's not in pain. She's not hurting at all. She's just nervous. Easy, mama. You're okay, girl. She's probably gonna come out, take three steps, and turn around and look at the view. How'd I know that was gonna happen? All that bellering is just because she's scared. Nothing's wrong. Most of them don't. But every now and then you get one that's just really nervous about being separated from the group. 
And that's kind of typical for a herd animal. That's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Till next time, catch you on the flip flop. Bye.